So it's very important for patients with lung cancer to take care of their lungs and their general health. And um, maintaining um, the care of lungs involves having, for example, having annual vaccination against influenza, of m maintaining pneumococcal vaccination, of having an action plan for if there's underlying chronic lung disease such as emphysema or, or bronchitis, and that action plan will relate to the management of acute respiratory infections. And so there may even be a prescription um, for antibiotics or for a change in, in inhaled or um, oral cortisone and bronchodilators. Um, main, maintenance of good general health, of course, uh, involves exercise, diet, relaxation, uh, taking a positive approach uh, to life. Um, relating with family and friends um, and of course we, we know that smoking cessation is incredibly important uh, in all people but particularly people with lung cancer. I've got three teenagers at home and you know they're all busy with school and sports and everything else so it's been I've got no immediate family at home so it's been yeah, really difficult in that respect. Um, tried to keep the life as normal as possible for them and uh, you know for as long as possible um, but now the traveling's been a bit of a pain in the bum but you know you cope <laughs> I'm a coper <laughs> you just have to the boys I've been totally honest with them but they don't understand that nanny will go um, so that's why I got the little kittens. Uh, I got them a little kitten each just to, yeah, so they'd have something to remember Nan by. And I've done memory boxes and I, I've written letters for when they're 18 and things like that. Well, after the treatment finished, um, I think David mentioned that it was really important that we went and had that holiday. I mean, we were lucky to be able to do that. And we had, we were very lucky. The weather was beautiful, the place was beautiful. We could move very slowly because we didn't have anyone else to worry about. I th that, and that was, we, we both felt, didn't we, much more normal when we got back from that. So I had to start a new life. So I went to the movies. I went out with my friends for tea and I went to places where they had music where you just stand and you jig, which I didn't think was dancing. And uh, went and watched my grandchildren play football and soccer. And as I said, worked and that was all I could do. But I'm quite happy. You have to remember uh, that we're working on it for our patients, but doctors and their families get cancer too. And so we all have a vested interest uh, in improving outcomes uh, for cancer, whether it be of the lung or any other organ.